Hi, my name is Christopher from Martinez Medical Systems. In this video, I will give you an overview of the Oxisoft user interface. The user interface can be divided into two main parts, the toolbar and the menu bar up top, and the workspace below. The toolbar provides buttons for easy access to common functions, like opening and saving a project, starting a new measurement, and zooming in and out of graphs. If a function isn't available on the toolbar, you can always find it through the menu bar where you can reach every single function and setting in Oxisoft. Further, it is also possible to customize the toolbar to include functions that you need. In the workspace, you find your project and measurements. Here is also where you can see your data and measurement related information during a measurement. Currently, there is a project open, so the project window shows an overview of all measurements contained in that project, each represented by a yellow folder. Each measurement in turn contains graphs. To display the graphs of a measurement in the workspace, select the measurement and click Open All Graphs in the toolbar. This brings up all the graphs of that measurement. When a measurement is running, there are additional interface elements that can be displayed in the workspace. Here I skipped straight to the measurement running. You can now see that there are three additional windows in the bottom of the screen. In the lower left is the DAC status window. This window shows information about the measurement such as file size, time elapsed and the status of the device. To the right of that is the DAC values window. And this shows the light received at each receiver transmitter pair. And it also shows in red if the light is out of range. To the right of that, you have the template DAC state. This is a graphical representation of the information contained in the DAC values window. And this simply makes it easier to locate the optodes when you need to fix them due to too much or too little light. That is the basics of the user interface in Oxisoft. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos. If you have any questions, have a look in the manual or contact us via askforinfo at artinis.com.